What happens when you can no longer work in Hollywood? You come to YouTube. Hello everyone, I am still Random 42 still the one, still the only, still your favorite consumer advocate YouTube harpy. And this is what happens. You used to have YouTubers like Lily Sings who would try and climb up out of YouTube to become late night talk show hosts and even go on to be award winning movie stars. That was the goal, right? They wanted to climb the ladder and be more and more famous. Now it's the other way around. Now they go from teen pop star to Oscar winner down to late night talk show host, down to YouTube celebrity. I'm not even joking. I'm not even joking. This has to be one of the most hilarious things. And I guess since Brie Larson can't get work in Hollywood, she wants to Brie in my sandbox, doesn't she? You know what I say to that? Drop the taco, get in the car. Oh yeah, we're bringing back all of the best of Brie, all the best of the Brie memes. <laughs> I know, and I'm very, very sorry for it. Miss Positive Energies herself. I don't have negative energies. I have loving energy. Brie Larson is now a YouTuber. <laughs> and it's not just she's a YouTuber. She's not even giving anything original. She is the most basic, generic, everyday, run-of-the-mill. You know those YouTubers when you're watching like a YouTubers react on the Fine Brothers channel and you're looking at all these YouTubers and you're like, I don't watch any one of these people. I don't know who any of these people are. Because when I watch a really famous YouTuber, they're going to have a cute dog or a cat in their channel. That's really all I care about if I'm watching the really, really famous ones. Or your MXR plays. I like their stuff quite a bit because they're really entertaining. Now, <laughs> you, you, guys, you guys don't believe me, do you? You, you don't. There she is. <laughs> Now, now, Chef Carolyn sent me this one. Sandra Hammerslag says, get your taco, get your dirty taco figures out of my sandbox. I know. I don't understand what, what I did, what we did to get this gift so early. Here, I was thinking maybe she was going to be in Star Wars and we could meme her weird cringe interviews. That's like one of the perks of being a Jedi is you get to build your own lightsaber. <laughs> Crazy. I was like, what? What? I just have things coming out of my hands. Like, I need a lightsaber. <laughs> oh Which is fine. I love memeing the weird cringe interviews. Uh, you want to see my crank? I mean... She made a decision to downgrade from actor to YouTuber. And we find this adorable. All right, so this is right off of her Twitter. Check, check. Hello. Hi. Hi. Oh, and her nice professionally edited YouTube video that she probably sent to some editing company and paid a lot of money for it with her professional sound, professional audio track underneath. Also, thank you so much, Matthew Hooker. Thank you very much and subscribe. Also, yes, thank you guys so much. Like, subscribe, share. Hi, I'm sweating. Who are these Hi, people? <laughs> I don't recognize any of these people other than her. Her, this one. This one I've seen. This one I've seen on YouTube. I've seen this one on the on the Fine Brothers React. I don't know who she is, but all these people are like super professional level, you know, with real professional editors, professional lighting. These are the people that I don't consider YouTubers anymore. These are the people I consider your, your YouTube corporate celebrities. And that's what she's downgraded to. You know what? In five years, she's going to be in a bedroom like me, right? Is that's what that's what's going to be. Videos and now we're talking and I... <laughs> oh my God, well, I'm equally fangirling. <laughs> and welcome to the internet family. Welcome to YouTube. Yeah, all these YouTube people that I don't know. Oh, you, you guys, you guys think it's fake. You guys think it's fake. No, she's got a real YouTube channel, and yeah, I did skip through her video. Now, I can't play you any of it, but it is all pretty much more of the same. She's got her Lily Sings there, and she's got all of the all of the little boring YouTubers that I've never watched or cared about. I'm scared. I have so scared. Uh, no, we're not playing your video, because I don't want to get... Say, see, there's Lily Sing. Oh, you're Lily Sing. Didn't she get fired from Late Night? Is that the thing with her? Because I don't, I don't watch Lily Singh. I don't know anything about her. Didn't she get fired from Late Night or something at one point? This isn't, this isn't being a YouTuber though. This is just being a YouTube celebrity with your professionally edited videos, your professionally edited people, your YouTube celebrities that get 
5 million views per video. It's kind of hilarious that she has the cringiest, and I'm bringing back cringy, she has the cringiest, most basic, professionally edited YouTube video that I've ever seen. No, those YouTubers on Bree's video, Sander Hammerslag. Oh, yeah, these YouTubers. Okay, what'd you say? Let me scroll back. ADHD. Oh, those YouTubers. Yeah, those are YouTubers who jump cut every two seconds. And that's what she did. She jump cuts every three words. For crying out loud, I jump cut from time to time. I don't jump cut every three words, though. Sometimes I have to because you can use the YouTube editor. It's really, really easy just to trim out if you start going on a tangent. If you oh, do something like that and you want to cut it out. Especially edited for all those juicy views. But Brie is just the gift that keeps on giving, isn't she? She's just this treasure. And you know what? Don't bother her on her videos. I don't need to comment on her videos. I don't need to be in her live chat. I don't need to watch her stuff. Because it's just the same boring crap. It's the same five YouTubers that I don't watch anyway that are over there on the React channel. Because you know what? With the React channel... The people who, you know, the kids react and the old people react, those are more fun than the YouTubers because the YouTubers come in and they always try and YouTube it. They always try and come in and take control of the situation. They always try and talk constantly because they're used to feeling that dead air. So when they have like two or three of them in the room on those react videos, it's just a nightmare. It's just crazy. You, If you really, really want to be a YouTuber, all right, all right, welcome to YouTube. You are going to have a blast because what? You have nothing else to do in Hollywood, right? That's my whole point of this. She has no work in Hollywood. She has to go and be a YouTuber. Really? And, and this is the thing. You think you're taking away from me. Now, I watch this video and she says, oh, I'm going to talk about activism and I'm going to talk about isms and phobias and all this stuff. You know, the same crap that she says every time she gets up and does her little speech. I just see people and I just play people. I didn't play Captain Marvel because I wanted to be a hero. I just wanted to be a person. <laughs> well, you're going to be a person now. You're going to get a lot of comments you probably don't like. I wonder, what are the comments like? Let's read through her comments. Let's see. Oh, what are her comments? Oh, they're on. They're on. Her comments are on. Let's read through her comments. Let me guess. A lot of people are probably... <laughs> Give me ideas. What do you want to see and who should I collab with? 489 replies four hours ago. Uh-huh. Gaming videos, covers, stories. Yay. Randy Smith, just saying hi. Well, thank you so much. I owe you guys two jiggles after the video that's clipped. So there's her pin thing. You should collab with... <laughs> oh, oh, here we go already. You should collab with Harvey. You know Harvey. You know, bad guy Harvey from Hollywood, whose personal assistant was Leslie Headland in charge of Star Wars. Yay. At least the new one. After scrolling through the comment section, I have come to one conclusion. The comment section will be turned off after videos. <laughs> yep, absolutely. I don't know how, but please collab with Critical Role. I don't know who they are. Stick sex and hammer. <laughs> you, you know, if you guys did really want to, on my behalf, say I should, she should collab with me. Or, you know, the fandom menace women like myself, Jesse Milestone, Anna, that Star Wars girl. Any of us. Because, you know what? You're, you're in our playground now, Brie. You're in our playground. This is our neck of the woods. Welcome. I can't wait for the hard-hitting, action-packed, anti-ist rhetoric. Collab with the quartering. He's such a big fan of yours. Ooh, she didn't, she didn't reply to that one. She did not reply at all. I second this. <laughs> don't see, see, sweetie, don't open the room if you don't want your questions answered. You probably shouldn't. E Fapper Mahler, absolutely. I'm a huge fan of Regal in Time. I would be interesting to collab with Jeremy from Geeks and Gamers. <laughs> it's a Gundam. It's an epic YouTuber. Oh, I know it's a Gundam. She collab with the quartering. This is going to be so, so hidden. Sure, her comment section is going to, she's going to be slammed. My wife's boyfriend says he really likes this too. <laughs> Don't you love this? She should collab with PewDiePie. Ooh, send her the remix. Oh, the Brie Larson remix. Did we play this already? Did we play the Brie Larson mega mix? You know what? We'll play it in the background here. I just see people and I just play people. Drop the taco. No one. <laughs> oh, she monetized already because she's Brie. Drop the taco. I need to be a person. I just see people. 
just <laughs> seeing a lot of quarterings. Nobody's mentioning me. See, nobody loves me. I don't think anybody wants me to collab. I don't think anyone wants me to collab with her. That's the thing. Nobody wants me to collab with her because nobody's mentioning me. Ah, oh, well. <laughs> Is this some kind of a personal attack? Is that personal attack? <sighs> for F uh, for oh, oh FFS 2020 just officially ended itself seriously no one asked for this oh this is wonderful what else does it say two weeks before this comment section gets turned off for he or heavily sanitized <laughs> I'm a 40 year old white guy is this channel for me did it, does she respond no it wasn't made for you <laughs> Yeah, it is for assuming that. The comment section is just great. The comment section is better than the videos. We don't even have to watch her crapping stupid videos. We just get to watch her comment section. Ah, maybe she should collab with Chris Hemsworth. Maybe she should. <laughs> do a stunning and brave video with a quartering. She'll never do it. See, I'm, not, I'm, I'm jealous. Nobody's mentioning me. Nobody loves me. Nobody says, oh, you should collab. I want to send money. She should collab with Deer Girl. Ooh, she, sh she should totally collab with the Deer Girl. That would be fun. That would be great. Shouldn't Brie be on Twitch with the other thoughts? You know, maybe. I don't know. Usually usually the gamer girls on Twitch at least have something to offer. The, I'll be the first me. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. <laughs> Imagine if Brie goes on one of those react videos. Oh, boy. Well, yes, would she be a YouTuber or would she be a celebrities react? That's the thing, because... See, when your star is on the rise, you want your name to be like, I want to be the Brie Larson, you know, reacts to. But now she'll just be relegated to YouTubers react. She'll just be lumped in with all the others that I can't name. And it's delicious. Don't you think it's funny? Don't you think it's funny? Do you guys want to go? Here's a link to the video. Don't harass her. Don't you be nice. You be nice. She's never said anything mean to me. Other than her marketing account people or whatever incognito thing that she has if she actually talks to me. Here we go. Planks of Wood cannot react. There's her video. We shared it. We did the nice thing. I did thumbs down it because I don't really care what she has to say. And she's not really my cup of tea. But then again, I did not get recommended this one. You guys sent it to me. This isn't the type of video I watch. Except out. did you watch the Hot Ones video? Not yet. Well, we will watch that in a second here. I am going to go back to my live chat. I will heavily edit this one down just for the funsies. Oh, this is fun. Bree is coming and playing in my sandbox. And you know what? I couldn't be happier.